and we're back and this time I'm going to show you how to create a world icon in Adobe Illustrator. On the view I've got a smart guide and snap to point only activated and I've got a black stroke no fill. Let us start with the ellipse tool I'll hold shift on the drag pad and I keep the stroke weight to one point. Use the selection tool and hold alt to drag a copy out of it. We need another copy and the overlap is important to us. Select it all, hold alt and get rid of it with the shape builder tool. Now align both elements to the center and we'll size up the center one holding alt and I've already created a copy from it. But when we do that in the center horizontally, it doesn't create what we want. So it's a good idea to just create a grid on top of it. Use the rectangular grid tool and the smart guides help you finding the correct position. Make sure it's still selected, go to view, guide and make guides. We need a line segment tool later on, but let us zoom in a little bit. And now we can size this one up vertically. Once again, I hold Alt when I do that. And then I copy it with the selection tool holding Alt and I'll put it to the next grid. And I drag that to the left. And I set the one that we've created horizontally it doesn't look good. We need to find a different method to create that. Let us first create the center lines horizontally and vertically with the line segment tool. That's good. And even if we size that down, it's not really what we want. So let us delete them. And we're going to pick a different method, which is simply using the line segment tool again. The grid helps us in finding good intersections. And now we'll use the anchor point tool. Uh, where was it? Right there where the pen tool is. Just go to the center and then drag it upwards. Don't hold any additional keys. So shift or alt, just release everything and drag it from the center always to the top. Use the selection tool, hold Alt and drag a copy out of it. Then right click transform. Let me put that down so that you can see it. So right click transform and reflect. We want to have it horizontally reflected and then press OK. Move that downwards until you fit the path of the circle. And it looks fine. We'll repeat the process once more. So line segment tool, use the guide to find good intersections, then use the anchor point tool, drag it a little bit to the top. Uh, maybe, maybe that was too much, a little bit less, something like this. Use the selection tool, hold alt and drag a copy out of it. Then right click transform reflect. Let me get rid of the guides under view guides clear guides. I select it all and increase the stroke weight. And now you can Use your eye if you want to readjust it a little bit. And then group it. And this is how you can create this world icon in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.